okay i have a problem and the problem would be that i am now on book talk and that has proven to be very dangerous to me i was wandering through this wondrous store um it's not very popular it's called target i was in the book section and i noticed this little little like red book calling to me a court of thorns and roses and i picked it up and i walked out of the book section and i said no i don't read so i'm gonna put that back so i put it down and then i went almost up to the register and sprinted back to get the book i was <clears throat> five or six chapters in when i decided i was absolutely in love with the book and ordered the rest of the series I've read 200 pages in A Court of Mist and Fury in one day, from like 4 o'clock until 11. I read 200 pages. So the love for this book, the love for the whole Akatar series so far, I just started A Court of Wings and Ruin and I'm forcing myself to go slow because I don't want to finish the series fast nothing in my mind is going to top how that series makes me feel this obsession is so intense it's my newest hyperfixation okay everybody in my life is well aware of this and i need to tell everyone that i see just how good it is so of course i have been looking at a guitar merch that i could do or little things that i could get to show my support the thing about me is that I am a Funko Pop collector. I had a huge collection not too long ago. I've lessened my collection. I need some characters for Akatar. So, obviously, I gotta make me some pops for the Bat Boys and for Lucian because they're my favorite characters. I really want to do one for Feyre and Elaine, and I'm debating on Nesta because I have mixed feelings about Nesta. I need a reason in my life. I need him, okay? It's not funny anymore. It's not funny. Just in case you want to make one for yourself, if you like the way mine turns out, I'm going to be using the body from this pop, and I'm going to be using the head from this one. I have already made Cassian, Asriel, and Lucian. The only things that are missing are bat wings. This is my Cassian. This is a Superman head, the, the body. That's from The Witcher. This is my sweet Asriel. This is um, Newt Scamander's head and Flash, the Flash body. And then we gotta get to my sweet Lucian. This is a Lord of the Rings pop because we are going to travel to the Akatar series. <laughs> I have my fairy ears. We're gonna wear these in support of Curse Breaker as we make Reason, darling. I have my two day old cup of paint water. It doesn't matter that it's two days old because it is paint water and we're not drinking it, so it doesn't matter. I am channeling my in a Feyre to unleash my creativity with painting. To start off, what you're going to do is you are going to remove the heads of your pops, both of them, because we're not using the head for this one, we're using the body. So we're going to remove the head from this one using half a cup of hot water it's steaming in my face i don't know if you can see it or not but you put it in the microwave for two minutes so that way you can dump the head of your pop in the water and it softens the plastic you dunk your pop in the water for 
I'm impatient, so I give it about 30 seconds. I kind of like these ears, even though they don't match my red complexion. I have an audience that you cannot see. I have Cass over here, Miss Cass. She thinks she is invisible behind the clear protector that goes over the pops. And then we have Sir Edward back here in the shadows. He's my shadow singer, my spy. Try not to scold yourself like I do a few times when you rip the heads off. So I ran into a little bit of a problem, a little bit of a difficulty, taking the head off of um, Tom. The neck disc is not coming off of the neck. His body is submerged in the water and hopefully I'll let it sit for a minute and it will come right off. Moving on to the head. To put the glitter on the eyes, I'm going to put a little bit of Mod Podge over his eye because Mod Podge dries clear. And then we are going to put glitter on there. So I think this is the color that I'm going to go with for his sparkles in his eyes. Should I do like a dark purple over the eyes first before I do the glitter? I'm not using any kind of fancy paints. I'm literally using this is the only purple that I have. So we're going to have to make this very dark for it to work for Reese's eyes. Well, I lied because to put the head on the body, you're going to have to dunk it in the hot water again and pop it on there. And here's the issue you run into. If you paint this first, when you dunk it in the hot water to heat it and get it soft again, the paint rubs off. So my advice would be paint this first so you can get all the colors of the shoulders and everything, and then heat this up, pop it on and paint your head. What color should I do his suit? Should I do the all black suit so he fits in with Cassian and Asriel? Or should I do like the black suit and then make the shirt like a dark purple? She's so cute. Oh my god! And my spa master. Don't talk about the white spots on my floor. Um, I got a piece of the foam boards <laughs> wet and left it on the floor and kind of forgot and it peeled off on the floor and now I can't get it off. What I'm going to do is I am going to do the black suit, but I'm going to make the center of this, like the middle shirt, a super dark purple. Kids. Okay. I'm going to do the purple first. That way I can be messy with it and then just cover it up with the black. All right, purple part is done. And now I'm just gonna take the black all over the rest of it. It hasn't even been like five minutes and I already decided that I hated the purple on the shirt. So I just did it all black. So that's what we're going with. He's going to match his shadow singer and his warrior. All that's left really that I can do tonight is the head and all we're gonna do to the head is literally just paint his eyes that dark purple color that I originally went with for the shirt and then I think I'm gonna do the bluish black because she describes his hair as being bluish black we're going to do Reese's eyes first because I already have this color mixed up. It's a color that I did on the shirt to begin with that I didn't like. Okay. I have the purple on his eyes. Like I said, it's not super intense because I don't think it needs to be super intense. Now moving on for hair color. We're just going to mix the black that I already have down there and a little bit of blue. We'll see how this looks. My last step before I call it quits for tonight, since I don't have wings and I'm gonna have to repaint the suit too because I think it has smudged. 
in places. Last step is going to be taking a little bit of Mod Podge over the eyes so that I can put just a little bit of glitter on there. All right. Cool. Oh, he's looking so nice. I am not even giving my hair time to dry because I finally, finally got the wings for my pops and I have to put them on right this second or else I'm gonna, I have two different size sets of wings in each pair. And I honestly think I was looking at the little ones and I thought, oh, these are so cute, but we're talking about the bad boys. We need bigger wings. So these might end up being what I use. I have three different sets picked out for each of the boys. I'm going to have to put them low on their backs just so there's actually space for them. I definitely think the bigger ones are what we're going to go with. Oh, Cassians are going to look so good. They're done and they look so I honestly think each set of wings fits them so perfectly. It I could not have picked better wings for any of them. And we got a sweet little Lucian in the middle. I can't forget Lucian. He is like our honorary bat boy. I feel like each set of wings fits them so perfectly. And I wanted to do different sets for each of them so they looked like they're their own person, if that makes sense. But something that I realized whenever I was gluing the wings on is... Spoilers. If you haven't read the Akatar series and you want to and you don't want any spoilers, I'm about to give a little one. Um, so just go ahead and fast forward towards the end of this. Or just click off. It's fine. I ended up giving Cassian the set of wings that had holes in them. So there's that. But anyway, they're done. And I have already started reading Fourth Wing. Not that you cared to know that. But I just wanted to let you know that I have started Fourth Wing now. My reading obsession has begun and it's it's coming out full, full force. Um, I still have not read A Court of Silver Flames. That is next on my list after I finish iron flame but also aside from reading next on my pop list today is the fourth wing characters so that'll be coming soon if you enjoy these i enjoy making pops and hopefully you can get some inspiration to do it too because it's like really cool you get to have something that nobody else has and you made it anyway thank you i'll stop rambling now I'm so happy.